it's harder when you're the one emasculating, said Emily Blunt's well-known ex-boyfriend after her $326 million movie with Anne Hathaway made her Hollywood's top diva. Since their wedding more than 10 years ago, Emily Blunt and John Krasinski have maintained a loving partnership that stands out among the sometimes short-lived celebrity marriages. However, before finding their ideal partner in one another, the two were involved in a number of well-known partnerships. However, for Blunt, things didn't work out well with her previous boyfriend before being married to Krasinski. Michael Bubble, a Canadian Canadian musician, and Blunt dated for three years during which time they made numerous headlines before ultimately splitting up. The Oppenheimer star has kept most things under wraps, but she did once make a hint about the events that ultimately caused her breakup. Although allegations surfaced that Michael Bubble was having an extramarital affair with Emily Blunt, which led to their breakup, there isn't much evidence to support these assertions. Although the Oppenheimer star declined to address the accusations of infidelity, it did make a suggestion about their possible causes by suggesting that her success may have been the primary cause of their breakup. Given that Blunt was still trying to establish herself in Hollywood when she first connected with Bubble, it's possible that her ascent to fame after appearing in The Devil Wears Prada sparked their breakup. Blunt stated, Michael Bubble expressed his thoughts about splitting with Blunt in great detail, saying that it had been difficult for him and that he was to blame for the sad circumstances. Speaking about his terrible separation with the Hollywood Alister, Michael Bubble pointed the finger at competing schedules. However, the singer did acknowledge that his actions may have also played a role, calling himself cringy and a jerk and expressing regret for how things turned out. In a conversation, the singer clarified, however, despite their regrettable breakup, Blunt wasn't significantly impacted since soon after she grew close to John Krasinski and the rest is history.